Hi friends! Welcome to my channel. In this video, you will discover an effective method to enjoy your best Goddess Primal Chaos game on a big screen, including a laptop. As you know, this is an Android operating system game, and we're going to understand how to run it on laptop. Simply focus on the screen and watch the video in depth. Without further wait, let me take the start. A URL has been displayed in the video description or maybe in the first pinned comment. This is the website link, I show it right here in case you want to see it slightly larger. Here is the URL of this game in Bluestacks. Set up Goddess Primal Chaos on your computer using Bluestacks. It is an Android emulator, which emulates tablets as well as Android mobile phone devices, so we can use a mouse and keyboard, use a big screen, etc. Go to the button, Download Goddess Primal Chaos for PC, to download this game, it will be put into downloads, see. Just press on this specific file now. In Windows 10, it'll have asked us for permission, we answer yes and then accept. Reduce the browser so that you can go to installation options. I am just going to choose the directory for the installation of Goddess Primal Chaos. If you'd like to modify the directory, then you can only push, customize the installation. Right now, we aren't much interested in changing directory, but we are going to click the, install now, button simply. It will just take several MBs from the memory space of your computer to download this particular file. For those who have a fast internet connection, then the file will be downloaded very quickly. It'll then set up the emulator on the PC. The installation of the emulator is finished now, and we are going to continue. Patience is needed for the first time only since the system will make several vital configuration settings for Bluestacks. Keep the eyes stick to the computer screen because we are going to describe a vital step now. This is an option for Google Play, sign in, you must just click here. When it comes to log in to Google Play, you will need to type email and password. Remember that game installation will not proceed without this particular step. We are also going to sign in now. Just wait, and we will simply sign in to Google account and see you after this step. We have been finally finished with this part. You'll be meant to accept the terms of use, and for this purpose, simply click on, I agree, we do not need to create the system backup, therefore, we will choose, no. The device operates just like a tablet or cell phone, and that's why it shows the same options as you can see in your mobile's Google Play. Anyway, we have eventually reached our Google Play account whenever you would like to get back to the desktop, press on this specific arrow. Before carrying on, look into the two icons it has created here, Bluestacks and also Bluestacks Multi Instance. The first option is to start the Bluestacks app. You need to click Bluestacks Multi Instance to set up this game simply. Now, let us ultimately set up the game on PC. Look, I will click on Google Play to install this particular game. There is an option to reset payment mode in Google Play as well, but it is not necessary. Now, you can observe, my computer is downloading Goddess Primal Chaos. Speedier net connection is recommended to complete the game download immediately. As it will require some time to download, thus, I am going to miss this step in the video tutorial. Now, we do not need to start the Bluestacks repeatedly, yet we can directly get access to Goddess Primal Chaos by hitting its desktop icon. Launching Goddess Primal Chaos on computer is now extremely easy, just click this icon twice and there you go. Just click here to start Goddess Primal Chaos and have fun. You can even modify the options of the keyboard from right here. As we are not eager to customize keyboard options, therefore, we will keep them as it is. If you'd like to enjoy Goddess Primal Chaos in big screen mode, then we will suggest two simple solutions. By clicking here on the Maximize bar, the screen will be enhanced. It would not be a 100% full screen. As we prefer 100% full screen, we'll just have to press F11 to enter the full screen mode, and then touch F11 once again if you want to exit the full screen. Once you start playing the game in the full screen mode, you will be able to better focus on the game. It is evident that playing a game in an emulator needs a lot of power, therefore, the performance will depend on the power of your system. Let's now rapidly check out the way to change the language of the game, we go on Preferences here. In the drop-down menu, select the game language you are looking for. And that's changed. Your favorite game has finally been installed. It's all set to play. Do not forget to like this video and leave a comment, we'll be pleased to respond. Thanks a lot, buddies, for your time. I hope this video will be helpful for all of you. Bye.